Finish points right here. 49, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44. You got that? 49, 44.
Now check your wing up to your armpit. So the purpose of this training for Victor 1-2 as well as Alpha Company specifically as the Ibex Company moving into our uh, strip maps next week, which is a squad infiltration, testing the this 2030 infantry squads. We're doing a series of physical assessments. So through the week, we've done a 500 meter swim where we tested the Marines' ability to move through the water, as well as we did a five mile run yesterday and then into the double O course uh, today. But each of these are an assessment where we can determine where we are as a unit, as well as we can compare both legacy units, our Charlie company, uh, to Alpha company with our different uh, experimental, the maturity of our, of our squad leaders, utilizing staff and COs as squad leaders, sergeants as team leaders, the ability to compare both physically uh, during the physical assessments as well as next week when we get into the tactical realm, compare across the two companies. So, so far I think it's going well. We're in the early stages of, of IBEX, so we're still getting some of the equipment, we're still getting some of the people. Uh, but we're, we're testing, this is what the Marine Corps wants us to do. So we're testing the idea of, of the new teams, we're testing the idea of having more mature unit leaders and how that's going to affect our ability to fight and win the future wars. I think as we look at Force Design 2030 and the new, the new infantry model, either way, whether we're legacy or experimental, we still need to be getting out here and doing the obstacle course. I think it's no different from what we've done in days past, the obstacle course is nothing new to the Marine Corps, and now we're just taking the new, the new model and the new 2030 infantry model, coming out here and doing the training that Marines have always done. In terms of how this impacts the Marine Corps as a whole, Alpha Company 1-2 being the IBEX company, again, getting out here doing the, the legacy obstacle course, some of the very natural physical events that Marine Corps has always done is going to make us more proficient. We're just taking a unit that has a little bit different people, have a little bit different things, still accomplishing some of the old tasks that were assigned to all, while also focusing on what the future of Force Design 2030 looks like and the infantry model in the future.